The Nigerian Senate has approved the death sentence as a penalty for drug traffickers in the country as it passes through the third reading, the 2024 NDLEA Act Amendment Bill. The proposal was adopted on Thursday when the Senate dissolved into a committee of the whole for a close-by-close -close consideration of a report of the chairman of the committees on judiciary, human rights and legal matters, and drugs and narcotics. National Drug Law Enforcement Agency Act Amendment Bill 2024, Senator Tahir Munguno. I am surprised that the committee is recommending a softer punishment. It was a life imprisonment. In fact, we should change it to death sentence. This is practice everywhere in this country that are serious about dealing with drugs. So when we come to take it close by close, please, distinguished colleagues, Let's change that section 11 to read death sentence, whether by hanging or whatever. This Check your mic. Okay. Senator Adam Sushomale expressed his displeasure over what he considered a hasty consideration in passage of the amended clause. Death. We must be honest, transparent in the decision. I am accountable to my conscience and to my community. That sentence is not a matter for A, nay, or nay. Everybody should vote so that we will be counted when it matters. Those who vote for death and those who vote for punishment. I, no, no, you cannot. We we'll take a vote. It's a, it's a fundamental issue. We are making law here. This is not a motion. I have responsibility for any law that I made while I'm in this parliament. No, we can't pass it because I don't believe that the nays, the highs have it. It's about life and death. Clause 11. Dealing with storage, custody of dangerous drug is amended by deleting the ambiguous word concern and replacing it with the word involved. For clarity, as the word involved conveys a broader range of activities related to storing, holding, moving, transporting, or concealing dangerous drugs or controlled substances. It encompasses various levels of participation in these activities. Clause 17, dealing with exportation of dangerous substances is deleted as the provision of the principal act, section 22, is contrary to the rule of double jeopardy, which generally prevents a person from being tried or punished twice on the same offense. As such, it is totally expunged from the act because it offends the, uh, the widely established rule of uh, double jeopardy that you should not be punished twice for one criminal offense. <laughs> The Deputy Senate President rejected an objection by Senator Shomale to reverse the ruling, insisting that it came late, which is against the rules. <laughs> 